Howdy, y'all. I'm Billy Bob. Today I want to show you guys a little bit of. Today, we're going to be doing the Get to Know Me tag, and Ethan and I are both going to be answering the same 20 questions, so yeah, let's, let's get to it. The first question is, what is your name? Ethan, what is your name? Ethan Kemper. What is your full name? Ethan Emery Kemper. Okay. I'm Terry Pearson. Like Sony Muhammad. Junior. <laughs> junior. Yeah, junior. junior. Fuck that shit. Junior. Anyways. <laughs> like Sony Muhammad, I'm one of the few people that do not have a middle name. So, Terry Pearson Jr., I guess, if you want to count the suffix. All right. What is your nickname? Eek. Eek. Because it is his initials. That or Biggie. Biggie. They did call me out all the time. My nickname, I, in school, I had people calling me TJ. Now, I'm out of school. I haven't had people call me TJ in a long time. So, <laughs> they're call, no, no, <laughs> they're no. Calling them too I can see the argument in the comment section already. When is your birthday? 12 1996. 06 29 00. 2000? Uh huh. <laughs> what is your star sign? Now, is your star sign like your, uh, like Capricorn and all that? I think so. I believe it's, you know, Capricorn, Cancer, and all that. Okay, so my star sign is a Capricorn. Mine's Cancer. He's gonna die. <laughs> what is my occupation? Now, oh, occupation is work. Career is... <laughs> my occupation right now, what, my job, I am doing roofing. My career, I own my own photography business, so yeah. High school. Because I'm still in school, guys, and sucks. And town and country. Oh, yeah, and town and He's country. He's facing the start at... Stock boy. Yeah. Uh, what color is your hair? Your hair is a brownish... It's 31. That's the what's burnt on my birth certificate. That's, I think that's what's on mine, too, is dirty blonde. Dirty blonde. <laughs> dirty blonde. We're both dirty blondes. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Uh, I can't see. What is the the camera is in my way? I literally cannot see the screen. What is, What was the last thing you bought? Taco Bell. I think last Gatorade. Thing I, no, Taco Bell. Yes, Taco, Taco Bell, Bell was the last thing I bought. Gatorade was the last thing you bought. Yeah, Gatorade. I bought Taco Bell last time, so yeah. Um, <laughs> we bought Gatorade because we went to the gym and worked out for a while, and then. We counteracted that by a few hours later. We went and ate a Taco Bell. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, how, how long, long is your hair? hair? Mine's, mine's his is short. Mine's medium. Mine's guy. If you know, if you know, like anything about haircutting or like shape, like shavers, whatever you call them, clippers. Mine's like a number four, because that's usually what I get my hair cut, and it hasn't grown much since. So I haven't got my hair cut in a long time, guys. So it's kind of just a medium cut, just eh, out there. Uh, let's see. Sorry, guys. I'm I I, I got the Come I got on. the questions on I the TV. It, I, it, I, I don't know. I'm explaining what's going on. I've got the questions on the TV, and I I made a mistake by setting the tripod directly in front of the question, so it's hard for me to see. So maybe Ethan can see. So let's hear Ethan. Yeah. What color are your eyes? Mine are green. Mine are brown. He got the crappy side of the situation. <laughs> That's so mean. What's your best feature? Boom! Wait. Boom! <laughs> um, my best feature is my face. My Actually, it's my goatee, I lie. My goat grows. I'm only 15, guys, so you gotta understand that Terry has nothing and I have a full goatee over here. We go to the store and people look at us and I'm like, can you believe I'm the older one? They're like, no, no we cannot. Yeah, fuck yeah. like all you. No, my best features is what I'm working on. My, my physique. Anyways. Um, now we are at... Do you have braces? No, no. I do not. I do not have any braces. Do you have any piercings? And we already know this answer. Yes, I do. I have two right here and I'll soon have one on my tongue, but yes. I've got... One piercing. I need another earring because I love wearing my earring. Uh, I haven't had an earring in in three years now because hey, you had one was it two years? Yeah. Because I lost my earring when I worked at Town and Country, which is the supermarket here in Newark. 
Uh, it's not even a supermarket, it's, it's just a store. It's just a market. Um, Alright, do you have any tattoos? No, I do not. Yeah, you do. You got the party dot. Oh, yeah, I can't lie. I got a party dot, guys. I forgot. I don't have any tattoos, no. It's not really a tattoo. It just kind of sits there. I don't even really recognize it anymore. It's a mole is what it looks like, but it's still ink. It's, yeah, not, it's, it's technically ink. a tattoo. Yeah, technically. Do you have any pets? Oh, I have, I have two. two. Yeah. I have two. I have I have one dog, she's a Chihuahua Jack Russell, she's old as can be. And I have a cat that demoness, he's black and he likes to stalk people in the middle of the night when you get up. Do I need to start naming my animals? Let's see. <coughs> We've got two dogs out back. Uh we, we got Lily. Buddy and Lily. Yeah. We've got a new Shih Tzu, which you've seen. We we got rid of one of the Shih Tzus. Uh we we sold her sold him. So we got the girl. So that's three. And her name's Sissy. And then we got three cats. We got Athena, Sister, and Baby. So yeah, we've got I've got six animals. Yeah. <laughs> um are you left handed or right handed? I am ambidextrous. I was actually born a left handed person. People in Florida couldn't teach me how to write left handed. They said it was the devil's writing. So yeah, I kinda I'm ambidextrous. I'm right handed, uh, but I do I can do some things with my left hand better. Wink, wink. Oh, the training. Mm -hmm. But, uh, Just yeah. <laughs> no. Uh, Alright, here comes the debate here. Uh, we want you guys to answer this in the comments, too. Answer these next two questions in the comments. Alright. 17 and 18. Okay. Mac or PC? PC. I'm a PC. I don't like Mac as much as I thought I would, but I, I like PC. It's pretty nice. I like, I like PCs, yeah. Okay, number 18 is iOS or Android? I'm an Android. I am an iOS fan. Actually, I, I hated iPhone for the longest time, but I got this one, and I actually do like it. It's an iPhone 5C. I actually like my iPhone. To be I've honest. got a cheap Android, which is over there somewhere, but I'm an Android person because they are an open source. I love Android. I don't like iOS. Let's just keep going with the questions. Just keep scrolling down and answer them all. <laughs> you want to answer them all? Oh, why not? Okay, so we're going from 20 questions to 65. Agreed. Okay, 19, dogs or cats. I am a huge dog fan. I'm, I'm a cat dogs. fan. Me and dogs are. I'm a I'm a cat fan. I love cats because they're so friendly and playful, and just I I I'm a, I'm a soft-hearted person as it is, and cats are I love them. All right, now this one's kind of a hard question to answer, even though because you do there's a lot of people who say you know that their best friends is their girlfriend or boyfriend. Well, that's the best friend, yeah, but your actual best friend, like the one you grew up with. My best friend would have to be, is my buddy, Tyler. He, he's a bigger kid. I thought I was your best friend. <laughs> he was a bigger kid. He was kind of, he was kind of like, my, he looks exactly like me. He's just a little bit taller than me. And if he doesn't gonna, wear glasses. He's really cool, but yeah, he's my best friend. If we're going to go with best friends in that sort of way, uh, in growing up together and still in contact with each other, I'm going to have to go with Len O'Brien. I knew, I've known him since preschool. Preschool? No, no. I'm sorry, Lynn. Uh, me and you, we haven't hung out as much. Uh, I'm going to have to go with Jerry. We've hung out just about the same. My friend Jerry, Hannah, we knew known each other since about kindergarten, and we're still in touch now. And this is after high school, so, yeah. What was Jerry your, Lee, Hannah. Yeah, what was your first award? Oh, mine was the... My first award was a... I got a, I was a straight A student, so my first award was making straight A's in high school, or in elementary school. My first award, this is a Cushman Bulldog Tag. Cushman School is no longer in session, it is turned into a, uh, an alternative for Batesville School District, but when I went to Cushman, uh, this was for reading, I think. I think it was for reading. It was something to do with the library. I remember that. But it's a Cushman Bulldog tag. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys get a little bit closer look at it because it's really cool. I love it, and it's nice quality too. And I've had it for years now. So yeah, I love it. I haven't worn it in years because I don't want to mess it up. But this was like my first award. Now, if you want to talk about recent awards, I've got photography awards. But anyways, let's move on. <laughs> what is your favorite sport? <clears throat> Mine, of course, football. But that's because I'm like a huge football fan. I love football, but 
mine would have to either be like riding a bike. I don't know if it's considered a sport or BMX. swimming. S- swimming, swimming would be my favorite. I love yeah. swimming. All right. So, twenty three. When was your first real holiday? I the one that I can remember my very first holiday. I was two, and it was in Michigan with my grandparents. It was Christmas time. That was my very first holiday that I can remember. I don't. I don't know. I can't. I can't relate on any, like, as in holiday. I've never really went anywhere on the holidays. Uh, I mean, every year we go to my uncle's house. But that's still Christmas. like the first time you can remember it, though. Would the be. first time I can remember it, I don't even know now. I can't. I can't relax. So, uh-huh. I'm gonna say. Probably six or seven. Yeah, probably six or seven. Going to my uncle's house, and because I think that's probably when the well, tradition kind of started of going. Uh, on Christmas Eve to my uncle's to eat. What was your last concert you went to? Believe it or not, mine was a concert at a church back when I used to go to church and I wasn't, you know, completely against religion and shit, but... uh, Um, my last concert was a skillet and... (laughs) Skillet and Three Days Grace concert oh, at that Bites, Blues, and Barbecues. I got to watch that. That was nice. That that would have been cool to experience. Uh, what number are we on? We're on 25. What's your favorite movie? Oh, my God. Um, My favorite movie has to be... Damn. My, one of my favorite movies, one of them, has to be uh, Big Daddy. I used to watch that all the time when I was a kid, and... It's hilarious. It's got Adam Sandler in it. I don't know. My favorite movie has to be The Fast and the Furious, but it has to be the original Fast and the Furious. Number one. That's my favorite movie of all time. Okay, number 26. What's your favorite TV show? Oh. Well, does it have to be, does it have to be, uh, like, continuing? Like, does it have to be a TV show that's on now? No. Because one of my favorite, my favorite TV series, or TV shows, and I never saw it when it was on TV, but it was, I got it as a DVD set, and it came in seasons, so I know it was on TV at one point. Uh, the Black Stallion. My, surprisingly, my sister's grandmother, actually, no, technically, it's my grandmother. No, it's my sister's grandmother, it's not mine. My sister's grandmother gave it gave me a set of them, of Black Stallion DVDs for Christmas and one year, and I watched the shit out of those movies, and they're still my favorite movies. And it's just seasons, and it's like a mystery thing. It's really cool. Yeah, it's TV shows and all that. But no, my favorite TV show would have to be the Looney Tunes, yes. <laughs> I'm a huge Looney Tunes fan. I love the my Looney Tunes. My favorite, too. no joke, my favorite Looney Tunes <laughs> ever is Taz, the Tasmanian Devil. If we're favorite going with Tunes. current, still running TV shows, though, uh, we're, we're going to name that too. If we're going with current, still running TV shows, I've either got to go The Simpsons or Family Guy. Because I'm, st- I'm still a big fucking kid, so fuck it. <laughs> Current favorite TV show is still the Looney Tunes. It still runs in place. <laughs> Not the original though. It's no, like but baby they, Looney Tunes now. No, they have regular Looney Tunes still. They're just more advanced than what they were. More there. advanced. Yeah. All right, number. Like in my old classic. My old classic would be Tom and Jerry. Yeah, that. Yeah, they. That's got to be anybody's favorite, right? Tom and Jerry. Uh, if you grew I up, like, in, I like if you grew up in that era, in that age, and that's what you grew up watching. I grew up watching Wild the Coyote more, which I like. And that's pretty Kylie, yeah, Kylie you don't get that kind of violence anymore. Yeah, no. it, it sucks. Anyways, what's it's your, too violent. 27, what's your favorite color? Yellow! To be honest with you guys, my favorite color would have to be red. I like red. I don't know. Just red. <laughs> what's your favorite song? Ooh, I don't know. That's kind of a tough one. Hello, it's me. <laughs> What? <laughs> it's so difficult for me to talk about myself. I'm sorry. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> no, not Adele. Oh, fuck, no. <laughs> no, I don't know what my favorite song is anymore. I used to say, uh, I used to say Gretchen Wilson. I think that's what her name was. Um, uh,. What was it called? Red High Hills, I think. I don't know. I used to... Fuck, I've had so many favorite songs. It changes throughout the year, so I don't even know anymore, guys. My favorite would have to be... 
Um, actually, if we're gonna go with anything uh, right now, if I've got if I've got to come up with something, it's Omni, and or it's Omsi, however you pronounce his name, and it's a uh, cheerleader. Oh. Uh, I. I don't know. My favorite song would have to be Three Days Grace, though. It'd be it'd be one of the Three Days Grace songs. It's actually well, if we're going three, be, if we're going probably, with Three Days Grace, I actually then I, I completely lied. To be honest with you, it's Eminem and it's uh, Mockingbird is one of my favorite songs. That is my yeah. favorite song. To be honest, with you. I like Riot by uh, Three Doors Down. Anyways, uh, all right, what? What is your, your favorite, favorite restaurant? restaurant? Oh, man. You well, considering I've never really been out of town and been to a lot of restaurants, the only real restaurant that I've been to that they advertise on TV uh, would be Golden Corral. That's the only <laughs> restaurant I've ever been to that they advertise on TV. I went to uh, IHOP once when I was little bitty. Uh, we went to Texas. We stayed in a hotel, and IHOP was right across the street, and we walked across the grass and stuff and went and ate breakfast there, but... I was too young to really even remember part of that. I mean, I, it was still a good time. I can remember it, but, like, I haven't eaten there enough. But I ate Golden Corral mm, about a year ago for the first time. And my f okay, I can it's because I live in a shit town, and uh, everything's, like, an hour away. So. My, my, my favorite, to be honest, my favorite restaurant is Red Lobster. My grandparents took me there all the time from... Like, when I, as soon as I could first remember eating, like, crab legs, that's where they always took me to. Red Lobster. I love Red Lobster. Alright, um, 30, what's your favorite shop? I know mine. Mine's the Hobby Shop. The Hobby Lobby. You we don't have, have much around here, and we don't even... I don't you have one in Jonesboro. Yeah, I've never really been inside of a shop. Like, most of the places we go to is Walmart, or, uh, freaking... I don't know, Hastings is considered a store slash shop place, kind of. Yeah. So, yeah, it would have to be that. What's your favorite book? My favorite book, the series, has always been Cirque du Freak by Darren Shan. It's one of the first series, series? One series. of the first series that I ever completed. My favorite book would have to be, um, The Blood of Olympus, to be honest. And I've read most of the book. Actually, I made it halfway all the way down to the bottom. No, it. <laughs> As you said, what the fuck is that? <laughs> the Blood of Olympus. The Blood Sounds of Olympus like is by... Uh, it is. It's about Greek god, Greek and Roman gods. And it's about how... Kind of like... You guys ever... I don't know most of y'all have. Right, Percy right, Jackson, right, the lightning come on, thief. Come on. Yeah. That's, that's good You're the one that elaborates and takes for <laughs> I know. Uh... Okay, guys, we're going to continue this in just a minute. Jump cut. We're back, uh, guys. We're back. Okay, had some things to deal with. All right. Um, What's your favorite magazine? Well, mine actually would be the, um, Guns Fanatic, which you can't really find. Here. The only real magazine that I've ever really had or owned would be, like, the GameStop magazines that you get, like, every month. Oh, and that's pretty cool. The Game Informer? Yeah. Yeah, those things are pretty cool. Uh, which my brother had those. I didn't. But, yeah. What's your favorite pair of shoes? Well, I don't have any spe special particular pair of shoes. Um, I just wear, you know, Hughes shoes. I just, I, I'm kind of cheap. I just buy shit. I don't know. My favorite pair of shoes, like the ones that I've favorited He buys the, the fancy shit. Are probably Under Armour Spines. They're really comfortable. I already know the answer to the next question. Alright, <laughs> what's your favorite season? Winter. I prefer the spring. I kind of like springtime. It's quite nice. What's your favorite quote? A quote that, I, I don't know if I came up with it or, or if where it came from, but it's something that I live by almost every day. You'll find it on my YouTube channel, you'll find it on my Twitter, my Instagram. It is, I am me, and me is who I'll be. My favorite quote would be, live life to the fullest, guys. You gotta endure life as much as you can, because it's not gonna last forever, just saying. Uh, how are you? How are, your, how, are your, how are you currently feeling? I'm feeling all right. I'm feeling pretty good. You know, I'm feeling great. It's all right. It's a great day. It's raining right. outside. That sucks. But who yeah. was the last person you messaged? Um, um mine was my girlfriend. Uh, yeah, I, the last person I messaged was my girlfriend, Brianna. Tarek, from Vlogging Nation, my YouTube family. He was the last person I messaged last night. I haven't messaged anybody this morning. 
Tarek and my YouTube family uh, are the last ones that I have messaged. Uh, and Sony Muhammadad, he's you know part of my YouTube family. So yeah. Uh, which, by the way, guys, I tag you guys to do these challenges. Sony's already done it, so go ahead and check it out on Sony's channel. Uh, you know what to do. You can just go to my channel and over there on my YouTube family, just click on uh, over there and it, it'll take you to Sony's page, you know, whatnot. And I'm going to challenge Alexander and, uh, which I know Tarek really doesn't do vlogging anymore. He doesn't do Vlogging Nation. He does his fitness channel now, but I challenge his vlogging. I, I challenge him to do this for his vlogging channel. So, yeah. Uh, All right. Um, are you single or taken? I am taken, of course, just like I said in the last one. I just texted my girlfriend, but I am taken. I'm currently working on getting into a relationship with this girl that I really, really yeah, like. Yeah, that's like so a, you're kind of I'm, the I'm, halfway I'm, point. I'm, I'm, I'm like standing on the border. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, it could either go one way or I could just fall off the fucking edge. Yeah. And like, you know, things could go to hell. So. Yeah. Yeah. So, what are you currently eating? Well, well nothing. I'm nothing. My shirt. Um, I ain't eating anything, guys. It tastes, like, yeah, you are. You're chewing dip. That's, whatever the that's not chew. It's just, this is just sitting in my left hand. It cuts in my left hand. It's my nicotine. But, uh, <laughs> we do not promote this product. He's just an idiot. And I tried to stop him from doing it on my video, and he wouldn't listen to me. We do not promote dipping or cigarettes or smoking. Dude, I have kids that watch my videos, so you can't promote that shit. How does it sound like Grizzly promoted. <laughs> he, if he gets Done a YouTube channel... promoted, guys. Grizzly Wintergreen. <laughs> oh, fuck. Do not start dipping. It is addictive. Warning, kids. Just no, it's not. Don't. No. Yeah. Don't fucking know! Alright, let's move on before I slap this bitch ass. Okay. Um, well, what are you currently listening to? Nothing right now, I'm but listening usually, to Ethan. yeah, usually we listen to music a lot. We do. We, me and Terry, we listen to a lot of different genres of music. I don't know if you guys can see me. I'm down here, but I'm reading the questions. Um, I'm what to are you out. currently yeah. thinking about doing? Punching uh, Ethan in the knee. Uh, that, that works. I'm thinking about slapping Terry in the back of the head. Ow! Damn it! <laughs> that was my neck. Where are we? I don't even know where we are. What are you currently watching? Well, we're watching the camera. The camera and the TV. And what the number TV. are we on? We are on 42. 42? Okay. Now we're going on to 43. Okay. What are you currently wearing? I'm wearing I'm a white, wearing... a white V-neck T-shirt and some black shorts. I'm wearing some black a shorts. orange MMA shirt because this is what this is, and black sweatpants because I'm just lazy like that, guys. Um, do you want children one day? Well, not with him, no. no but, no. yes, but I would yes, love I to do. be a father. I, I, I love father. kids to death, and I am I want to be a father, yes. Yes. Do you want to be married one day? Yes, yes. I do, actually. I would love to I be I would married. love to be married and live a happy life. Where do you want to live? I personally want to live in Rio de Janeiro, but... I don't know many places, people, so I don't know. Uh, uh, people say differently. I want to live in Rio. That's me. I don't know, because I, I haven't really experienced a lot of different places, and so I haven't decided yet. Like, Do you believe in God? You can't say no. yes, and you can't say no. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I can say undecided, because I can say that I don't really care about religion, and you that have been watching my channel for a long time already know this. I don't really care about religion. I don't really care. Uh, I'm for everyone. But when it comes to religion stuff, I just, I hate it. I really do. Because in my opinion, religion is what started the wars and shit. Because if it wasn't for religion, we wouldn't have a bunch of shit. Anyways, before I get too elaborate on this, because this is an elaborate subject, because I will elaborate really, very, very, yes. very I Okay, yes, I do. I can say that. I do believe in God. Yes, I do. Now, 48, do you <laughs> believe in miracles? Yes, you I do. You believe in miracles? Yes, Juju. <laughs> That's a good song. Yes, I do believe in miracles. And actually, I believe in miracles, which is kind of interesting because actually, me and Terry had a we had a miracle one day. We were sitting there and we were like running low on gas and we were hungry. Oh, you and we, the Dollar General. <laughs> yeah, we, found, we were in a Dollar General somewhere in BFE and we found forty dollars sitting on like, the ground. I walked in because I was looking for a job. I walked in to see if they were hiring. They told me to go to a website. And when I walked back out, there was two $20 bills folded up in front of my car. It's like, 
Fuck yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah. Let's go get some gas and some food. Yeah, we were hungry. We were hungry. Do you believe in love at first sight? Actually, I do. No. I do. I, I do, but I don't because it depends. No, I don't believe in love at first sight because... I believe you should take things slow. I actually do agree with that. I do agree with your. I believe you should build it up, and you know you should you should get to know each other, and. I okay, I agree with you. Because love at first sight, in my opinion, is what like a lot of high school love is. Like you know, you date for like three week, three weeks, or maybe a month, and then it's like, oh, I'm done with you. Yeah, that's like. That's why me and my girlfriend have not broken up. That's love at first sight. Two years later, yeah, no. Um, I have to. I have to give a shout out. To my cousin Ricky Douglas yeah. and him and him and Christian, guys, I love you guys so much. And you just, you guys fight constantly. You constantly fight, but somehow you manage to stick together. And what? This is their third, fourth year together now, continuously fighting and sticking together. I don't know how they've managed it, but they have. And I want to say congratulations to them. Anyways, um, well, not like my cousin watches my videos, so we're okay. Anyways. What number are we on? Uh, do, 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 do I need to go scroll that down? Uh, no. Um, okay, 50. Do you believe in ghosts? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I do believe in ghosts. Uh, do you believe in aliens? Yes. I do. I do not believe that we are the only humans or only life forms in this universe. I, I just can't. That can't be true. Do you believe in soulmates? Yes. Oh, wait. Fuck. Never mind. Sorry. Go ahead, Ethan. I don't know where you're at. I, I was answering for myself. All right. Do you believe in aliens? Um, yes, I do. But what interests me in the most of that matter is because I have... Uh, there is a scientific study show because of how the Earth has so much pollution on it that there is a scientific study and there is a second planet way on the outskirts of the galaxy that is sustainable for life to live on it looks exactly like earth but the difference between it is is that it's a bit smaller and the average year-round temperature it doesn't change at all is 72 degrees fahrenheit that's it never changes even don't know that's what scientists have said i don't know i don't <laughs> i just messed that but i do believe there's something living on that planet yes i do um do you I believe, believe planet x do you believe in soulmates? Um, yes. Yeah. I do believe in soulmates. Um, do you believe in heaven or hell? Yes, I do. I don't know. I really don't. Uh, when, when I die, I'm going to find out. If I go to heaven, I go to heaven. If I go to hell, I go to hell. If I float here on earth, I float here on earth. So, undecided on that one. Um... Do you believe in kissing on the first date? No, I do not. No. Well, I have. I have done it on the first date. Actually, I lie. Yes, but I have, but... I don't, I don't, I don't honest, recommend it. Yeah, I don't recommend it, no. It could be too fast of a move, and then everything get ruined. They're like, oh, no, we're not right for each other. <laughs> All right, what does that say? Do you, do you believe, believe in, in yourself? yourself? Yes, I do. I am a champion. Shut up. <laughs> do you uh, sing in the shower? Yes, yes I, I do. do. <laughs> la 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> when do you, did you last laugh and what was it at? Uh, um, he just, just laughed. Now. Yeah. <laughs> because we were beating each other. It was kind of funny. Where uh, was the last place you traveled? Texas. Oh, uh, where was the last place? I traveled Michigan. Texas. Michigan. Was the last place that would you go skydiving? Yes, yes, yes I would awesome. love to go skydiving. Um, um, if you could travel anywhere in the world, where would you go? I would actually, to be honest with you, I'd go to Japan. As a photographer, I really want to go to like Oklahoma or uh, like Hawaii, somewhere to where I can get some really good pictures. I go. I want to. I want to go on a, on a photographer's like paradise. Trip. If you all had right. a million dollars, what would you do with it? First of all, well, for one, I would go with a Lamborghini. Sorry, um, um, I, I, that means I made it in life, and I own a Lamborghini now. I'm better than everyone. I'm better than fuck you. <laughs> no, no, I would own a house. I would. I'd, I'd buy a house. I would, I would spend buy it a decent car, 
And then the rest of it would get put away for things I'd need later That would on. probably be what I would do. I might buy a Lamborghini, but I would try to find one, like a used one. You can buy one for two grand, 200000 yeah. yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't blow half a mil on a Lamborghini. Can you whistle? Yes, I can. <whistles> can you speak another language? Yes, I can. Hola. Como estas? Ah. I see, I see. Yeah, okay. Piquito, me hable piquito espanol. Uh, anyways, um, I can speak Spanish. I can speak Japanese. Um, I can do a little bit of Japanese. Oh, my... Ni hao shushin ni ha. It means how is your day and how are things going? I believe I could build our own. I took a little bit of a Japanese class, but eh, here now. What's... I wrote. Um, now we're down. Uh, what's the most important in your life? What's most important in your life? This camera. I love you guys. This is most important to me. This camera. This is my baby. I love this more than my car. Most important to me in life is my family. Sorry, family. I love this more than everybody. It's my, it's my family. I don't... <laughs> Hi, family. That's so fucking mean. I'm like, have... sorry, family. I love this more than everybody. <laughs> if, if I didn't have family, then I wouldn't have anything. Um, <clears throat> have, have you ever, ever had, had surgery? surgery? Yes. No. Unless you count getting stitches surgery, but I don't think that's. Uh, I mean, there wasn't any surgery. I just sewed it up. Alright, surgery on money. Alright, guys. So that's all 65 questions. We went through that. I don't know how long this video is. Let me look. Oh wait, there's two parts to it too. So this is only 13 minutes. So yeah, um, yeah. So guys, hope you enjoyed it. If you want to do see something else like this, let us know in the comments. Ask me questions yourself. If we didn't answer a question, let me know. And if you want to know about a question, let me know. So I think that's gonna be it for us today. All right. Thank you guys. That was the get to know me tag. Uh, I challenged Alexander. Uh, and, uh, Tarek, I challenge you both to do this. Sony's already done it, so you guys need to catch up. Thank you guys so much for watching, and peace out. If you are anxious to see more videos on this channel, please click over here on the left annotation. Oh my god, you're still here. Oh my, oh my god, you're still here. Come over here. Follow me on these things if you like. If you think I'm subscribed worthy, then click on this shirt. Subscribe to me. Thank you so much for watching this video. Peace, peace, peace out. Peace, peace, peace out.